Hello and welcome to Script Academy. This is the first of many parts in a short tutorial series just helping you get used to Script and just learn a bit more about it. This is a beginner's course and we'll run through getting started with Script, how to create commands, variables, loops, add-ons and then how to handle errors. Before we get started to show your support and to keep these videos going please like and subscribe. So as you can see by the title in today's video we're just going to show you how to get started with Script. Step 1 Installation To download script all we have to do is search script download github Then we click on the first link to github release page Scroll down to the latest version which at time of recording is 2.6.4 You click the first link here the .jar file and that will go straight to your downloads As we always do on the LearnScript channel we're going to be using Mindfort LearnScript is a Mindfort affiliate so if you use the link in the description you can create your own free forever Minecraft server once we're logged in, we can see our servers. We go to Manage. Now that we're on our dashboard, we have our FTP access information. So we can go to FileZilla or any other file manager you choose. We can create a new site and add our host, which we can copy from the panel. Port is 21. Username, we copy this from the panel. Password, we copy this from the panel. And hit Connect. On the right here, we have access to our server directory. So we go to plugins, and these are the plugins I already have installed on the server. And then we drag our script jar file into this directory. To reload your server, all you do is go into the dashboard and hit stop. Then once the server is stopped, all you need to do is start server. Now that your server is back online, slash join your server name, type slash plugins, and script will be installed. We go back to our file manager, we refresh, we go to the script folder, which is within the plugins directory go to scripts and we can delete all the pre-made scripts now we right click create new file and we can name it anything so we'll just name ours learn script and it has to end in a dot sk now we right click that view edit and ours should open in visual studio code and that is it for this video in the next script academy video i'm going to be showing you how to create commands and dive in a wee bit more on what script can do for your server and why your server needs script to be able to compete with other servers if you did find this tutorial useful please show your support by hitting that like button and hitting subscribe thank you